Hi ladies, I'm Sandrine from Pronils and in this very uh, difficult and exceptional period I want to share some tips and tricks about how you can uh, take care of your nails yourself at home. So um, some of you had maybe the chance to get their nails done and they are now perfect, uh, so that's fantastic. But others of you had also an appointment to your nails and stylist and uh, it was cancelled. So you are now at home with an outgrow of three or four weeks. What you need to know is when you get your nails done, your na nail stylist is giving your nails a perfect shape, a beautiful shape and structure. Um, this shape is not only beautiful, this shape gives uh, the perfect uh, strength to your nails to avoid breakage and lifting. Now, when your nails are growing, the structure will also grow with your nails, but the structure will not be in the, um, the right place anymore. So there is no strength anymore for your nails. So it's time to do something. If you are uh, with an outgrow of uh, three or four weeks, you can shorten your nails the same size as you see your outgrow. Is it three? four or five millimeters, shorten your nails uh, with this, um, this same uh, size. But now if you have an outgrow or more than four weeks, five or six weeks, then it's time to shorten your nails completely. I will show you how you have to do this. But first, before we start, we will, um, it's important that we think about hygiene. So I already done, I wash my hands with the hand soap, do this at home also. Uh, other thing to do, if you have some disinfectant for your hands, use it, spray it on both sides of your hands, then rub it with your hands. Don't forget the fingers, don't forget the nails, also the thumb, and you let it completely dry. To shorten your nails, you will use a file. Please don't use a nipper because a nipper uh, will break your gel and it will cause many um, problems uh, underneath, uh, lifting problems, breakage problems. So avoid a nipper, use a file. Use a file with a soft grit so you can feel the file. Uh, for me, it's 180, but you can feel it with your finger on the file that it's not rough, so it's better uh, to, uh, to file. Before you use the file, also disinfect your file, both sides, and you can use a tissue to make it dry before you start. Okay, so now I will do this on my nails. So ladies, you will need to work on uh, both hands. I'm right-handed, but I will uh, work with my left-handed because, because this is the most difficult. You also will have uh, to do this. So start first with the most uh, difficult uh, part. Um, you need to see the nails um, clearly. So what you will have to do is to uh, turn your hand and you uh, switch your fingers uh, so you can see your nails, like the, the nail stylist uh, should see them. Then to shorten the nails, keep your file straight on the free edge to shorten. That's the first step you have to do. The second step is giving the shape. Then you will flip your file under the nail to give the shape. So first is to um, shorten. Keep the file straight so don't uh, take uh, don't pay attention to the shape now now what we want to do is to make the nails shorter once it's shorter and this is what you want to uh, to remove from uh, from the nail then you can flip the file under the nail if you don't feel comfortable uh, with the filing of your nails you just have to file on the corners to make the nail a little bit rounder and you can stop in a round shape, okay? If, that, if it's too difficult for, for you. Now, I prefer my nails a little bit more uh, oval, so I will stay under the nail, but I will work a little bit more on the sides of the nail. When I go on the sides, uh, here, pay attention that you stay under the nail. Don't file 
uh, on the nail because uh, there's a risk uh, to, to make ingrown nails. So I will work uh, more on the side, but stay under the nail, just because I prefer a more oval almond uh, shape. So file on the sides and try to file uh, as every um, the two sides the same uh, way. Always file to the center of the nail if you want a more uh, oval shape and stay under the nail. If you are happy with uh, the, the length and the shape, you can stop. You will have to remove uh, the dust. If you have a nail brush, it's better. So you can brush the dust uh, on the nail. If you don't have it, you do it like, like this to take the, the dust away. So that's the first part. Um, the length and the uh, shape of the nail is done. So now um, enjoy uh, this period um, to give some extra care to your natural nail and to your uh, cuticle. So if you have uh, a nail hardener, you can use it. It's like uh, a nail polish. So you place it on the whole nail. Otherwise, here I will use uh, a nail serum to feed my natural nail with a uh, lot of um, keratin. I put this on the natural nail only. It will dry uh, from themselves. It goes through the natural nail. It's very, uh, very fast. Then we need to take care of the cuticle. Therefore, I will use some um, cuticle oil. I put it on my cuticle area and with oil. You then have to do a little uh, massage to uh, put the cuticle oil into the skin and on your cuticles. Also, don't uh, forget we um, we have to disinfect our hands a uh, lot of time uh, in this period to uh, wash them more so take care of the skin of your hand and use some um, hand cream Enjoy this self message. So this extra care, you can do this um, every day, nail, natural nail um, feeding, and also the cuticle uh, feeding, uh, and moisture your uh, hands with hand cream. You can leave the, the, the nails grow like this. When they are too long, you shorter them uh, again. Um, now, if you find um, the not grow uh, color is disturbing for you, uh, what you can do is also use some nail polish. Um, if you want to use the nail polish, now that I use um, cuticle oil and hand cream, there are some greasy residue uh, on the nails. So what I first should do is to remove the greasy residue with some um, nail polish uh, remover. And the nails are then ready uh, to have uh, the, the nail polish. Nail polish, start the application with a base. Um, choose a dark, color 
because it depends uh, it depends on the color you have on your nails but with a dark color you will uh, cover any uh, kind of um, of color gel that you have and you finished with the finish layer so this is if you want a color uh, on your nails because the odd crow is disturbing for you um, so what do you need to shorten your nails you need a file to put some extra care to your natural nail and some extra keratin you can use a serum and you can use a cuticle oil to feed uh, the cuticle area and of course you use a hand cream and if you want a color you can put it afterwards so i wish you a lot of success with your nails and i hope you soon can go back to your nail stylist and uh, make beautiful nails again with new colors and new nail art but for the moment enjoy also those uh, family time uh, together and um, stay safe at home and take care of you bye